Welcome back to the channel. And no more scrubbing and shit. I did these pads. No more goddamn scrubbing and shit. They ass too fucking lazy to get out the car and go get them, go get a person they license back, but they weren't like too lazy to to motherfucking um you know stop them and get out and talk about license registration proof of insurance, but they too lazy. To Give them their license, walk them, give them their license back. But anyways, no more scrubbing. Just took the old pass back, got the money back. Uh, went to the gas station. Uh, I ain't gotta do nothing two o'clock when she go on lunch. She want me to come get her for lunch, I guess, so she can go get her something to eat. And uh, she go to the house and change. Get back in the clothes I had on this morning. What it is, because I'm definitely finna take this light. Uh, what it is, because I'm definitely finna take this light. But yeah, uh. Just finna head on to the house. She need to get the rotor. In the coming weeks, if not, I'll be changing these pads again in the next two or three months. So, either way, she good now. I ain't got to hit that uh, embarrassing ass scrub. One of the OGs at the shop, I was like, man, you just bring the four way back. I said, next time you bring that shit back. He like, man, as long as we took you to do them set of breaks, I could have did 20 breaks out. Hey, shit, I ain't in no rush. I'm not getting paid. I'm not getting no money off of it. I got to 2 o'clock. So, what's the rush? It's shit, like one of the other big homies say, when I had the Vic, shit, one day I took two hours to do my damn breaks. It's because I can't pay myself for working on my own car. And, um, you know, I ain't had nothing to do that Saturday after coming from the yard from getting some breaks. From getting some brake pads, I fuck this. I had to come from the yard getting some brake pads. I'm gonna go ahead and take side streets. So, I ain't had nothing to do, you know. So, what's the rush? I was at the shop for the day to make some money too. So, my car wasn't in the way of none of you know, paying customer cars. So, hell, I took my sweet ass hand doing my brake pads. And like I say, shit, I was telling this other guy we call him Broke Foot, you know. He, uh, you know, uh, I took, you know, like I was telling him, you know, if I come back there to the shop, you know, like the old, the owner of the shop, he always tell me get in the back colors, you know, of course I'm not a paying customer, so I don't get up front. It's very few times I get up front and that'd be like later in the day. But like now, now nah, I'm always in the back, which I don't choose about it. Cause you know, like I told him when I go ahead and I go ahead and knock breaks out, you know, that's because I got something I got to do, and I need the breaks in a short amount of time, you know, and I got something to do in a short amount of time. I said, OG, you know, uh, need, uh, you know, need all the spots because it's jumping, you know, he going to need all the spots, then, okay, you know, I go ahead and knock him out, but shit, just... Like today, like they now I take my time. And another thing I noticed, half the time when I try to change the brake shims, the new brake shims do not go on right. Well, the brake shims go on right, it just can't fight with the brake pad to get them on. So what I do is I don't even change the brake shims now. I just change the pads, you know. Uh, <sighs> you know, so that's how I do it. You know, but I got that video coming shortly. That video gonna be ahead of this one. I'm gonna upload that video when I get to the house, which I'll be there in probably about another seven minutes, you know, cause I'm finna stop at the store. So I'll be at the house shortly. Oh, he pushing. That's how we do in the hood, fuck a tow truck. <laughs> 